Hi, my name is Michelle Vega. Today we're doing vinyasa flow class. So go ahead and find your comfortable sitting. You may place your hands on top of your knees and begin with inhale. Inhale through your nose and exhale. You're welcome to close your eyes if you wish to. You may find that um, with each inhale you take, that your neck and your spine elongates along with it. Inhale. That the top of your head reaches all the way to the sky. Inhale. And maybe set your intentions in this practice. Inhale. You may begin to flatter your eyes open if you close them. Inhale. And with your next inhale, reach all the way to the sky. Inhale all the way up, all the way to the sky, and maybe bring your gaze along with it. Exhale, bring your palms together right at the heart center. And we'll do this a few more times. Inhale, all the way up, reach to the sky. Bring your gaze along with it, palms together right at the heart center. Inhale, reach up all the way. And this time, exhale, fold forward. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold forward. If this is not accessible or you have a block with you, go ahead and use that. And just breathe. With your next inhale, reach all the way up to the sky and maybe bring your gaze along with it. Your next exhale, bring yourself to the left. Place your left arm on top of your knees and the back, your left arm to the back of your mat. Inhale and exhale, maybe gaze. your left shoulder, inhale, and bring it full to the front. Inhale all the way up, exhale, twist to the right. This time, place your right arm to the back of your mat and the left on top of your knees. Inhale, and exhale. Maybe gaze your right shoulder, inhale, and bring it back to center. This time, you may switch your leg. So whichever is at the back is now at the front. Inhale, reach all the way up. And fold forward. And just breathe.
inhale all the way up, reach all the way to the sky, and release. Bring your left. Leg to the side. Inhale all the way up. Inhale, reach all the way up. And fold forward. If you can touch your toes, go ahead. If you can only bring your reach to your shin, that's okay. And just breathe. Inhale all the way up. Reach all the way to the sky. And release. Bring your right arm to the back of your mat. Anchor yourself using your left heel and reach all the way to the back of your mat. Inhale. Just breathe. Switch our leg this time. So go ahead and, and extend your right this time and inhale all the way up, reach to the sky. Bring your gaze along with it and fold forward. And just breathe. Whenever you're ready, inhale all the way up to the sky. Reach all the way to the sky. Bring your gaze along with it. And release. This time, bring your left arm to the back of your mat. Anchor your heel. And reach all the way to the back of your mat. And breathe. And release. This time we'll go to our table top position. So go ahead and place all ten fingers to the ground. Find your neutral. your toes or just face it all the way to the ground inhale all the way and look all the way to the sky drop the belly cat cow pose and just breathe here with your next exhale round the back slowly Vertebrae by vertebrae. Tuck in the tailbone. Bring your chin to your chest. We'll do it a few more times. Inhale, drop the belly. Open the chest. Look all the way to the sky. Cat cow pose. Exhale. Tuck in the tailbone. Tuck in the chin all the way to your chest. Maybe look down. Again, inhale. Drop the belly. Open the chest. 
look all the way to the sky. Exhale, fold, tuck in the tailbone. And breathe, find your neutral. All 10 fingers still. All pressing to the ground. Tuck your toes. And we'll meet to our dog downward pose. Go ahead. Maybe your heels not touching all the way to the ground. But that's okay. With your next inhale, lift, kick the right leg up all the way. I like to point my toes. You can really feel that on your hamstrings. And with your next exhale, Swing it to the front of your mat. Lower yourself and untuck the toes. Reach all the way up, all the way to the sky for low lunge. With your next exhale, bring your arms all the way pointed to the back of your mat and just breathe. Relax. We'll do it a few more times. Inhale all the way up, reach all the way to the sky. Inhale. And exhale, point your arms, your hands towards the sky. Maybe look up, maybe gaze the stars. Open your chest and just breathe. Inhale all the way up. And release, place all 10 fingers to the ground. Tuck your toes and bring yourself all the way back to downward pose. If your heels not touching, that's okay. So whenever you're ready, Lift the right, left leg this time all the way. You're welcome to point. You're welcome to just re relax. And whenever you're ready, kick it to the front of your mat. Lower yourself down. Inhale, reach up all the way to the sky. Maybe bring your gaze along with it. And just breathe. Your next exhale. Point all ten fingers towards the back of your mat. Maybe look to the sky, open the chest. Inhale. Again, inhale, reach all the way up. And exhale, reach all the way to the back of your mat. All 10 fingers pointed to the back of your mat, maybe. Bring your gaze all the way to the sky, open your chest, and just breathe. Again, inhale all the way up and release all 10 fingers facing the ground lift yourself back up 
to a dog down on it. We'll hold it here for five, four, three, two, one. With your next inhale, lift the right leg. Bend it to your left. Whenever you're ready, bring it to the front like a figure four. Lower yourself down. We're coming down to our pigeon pose. And whenever you're ready, bring yourself all the way down your forehead to the ground. And just relax, just breathe. If a block is accessible to you, you may place that. If that's better for you. And just breathe. Relax your jawline, relax your shoulders, just relax. Whenever you're ready, Inhale, big inhale, reach all the way up. And fold forward. Inhale all the way up. And exhale, plant all 10 fingers to the ground. And tuck your, tuck your toes and bring yourself back to downward dog pose. Go ahead, take your time, no rush. Maybe adjust from front to back of the mat. Maybe settle your feet. So whenever you're ready, inhale all the way and reach this time with your left leg. Bend it to your right. Bend your knees to the right. And swing it to the front of your mat like a figure four. Lower yourself down, and whenever you're ready, fold forward. And just breathe, relax the jaw, relax the shoulders. Maybe you wanna try and just bring your fo show, um, forehead all the way to the ground. Maybe sway your forehead from left to the right and just breathe. Notice perhaps this side is a bit different than the other side. And that's completely okay. With your next inhale, reach all the way to the sky. And fold forward.
just breathe. With your next inhale, reach all the way up. And release. Place all ten fingers to the ground. Untuck your toes. And bring yourself to a tabletop position. Neutral. Neutral. Inhale, drop the belly, open your chest, look to the sky, cat-cow pose, and just breathe. With your next exhale, bring yourself down all the way to the back of your mat. Adjust your hands and just fold. Child pose. Place your forehead to the ground and just breathe. Next inhale. Lift yourself. Open the chest. Drop the belly. Cat cow. Pose. We'll do this a few more times. Exhale, bring yourself down to child pose. Bring your forehead to the ground. Inhale, lift yourself up, gaze all the way to the sky, open your chest, and exhale, child pose. Just breathe. Whenever you're ready, place the left arm under your right. Place your ear, your temple to the right side. And just breathe. Whenever you're ready, bring it back to the center. Bring your forehead down to the ground and just breathe. Whenever you're ready with your next inhale, bring the right arm this time under underneath your left and maybe place your temple your ear to the left maybe gaze at your thumb and just breathe inhale Whenever you're ready, bring it back to the center. Lift yourself up to a cat-cow pose. And just breathe. Untuck your toes. Bring yourself to a plank pose. Lower yourself down. Place your forehead to the ground. Maybe place 
adjust your fingers just mid rib and just breathe inhale half lift for baby cobra exhale forehead all the way to the ground inhale half lift for baby cobra or you can bend all the way exhale fold Forehead all the way to the ground. And just breathe. Whenever you're ready, extend your right arm. Twist your body to the right. Place your temple, your ear, and anchor yourself using your foot. And just breathe. You can stay here if you wish to, or you can interlace all 10 fingers and breathe. You can release all 10 fingers. If you interlace them, place your arm back to the ground. Place your hands back to the ground. Your forehead to the ground. Inhale for baby cobra. Exhale back to the ground. Inhale for baby cobra. Or you can lift yourself all the way up. And exhale all the way back to the ground. Plant your forehead to the ground and whenever you're ready, extend your left arm this time. All 10 fingers facing the earth. Twist your body, place your temple, your ear to the left, anchor your foot to the right, and just breathe. You may interlace all 10 fingers if you wish to. Or you can stay where you are, where you at, where you're more comfortable, and just breathe. You can release all 10 fingers, place your hand, twist your body back. Place both arms mid cage, just below your forehead, back to the ground, and just breathe. Whenever you're ready, tuck your toes. Lift yourself back up for downward dog. You may adjust whenever necessary. Maybe pedal the toes, 
bend the knees a little bit. Maybe bring your body from front to the back of the mat. Whenever you're ready with your next inhale, lift the right leg. And with your next exhale, kick it back to the front. You may adjust your back leg. Whenever you're ready, Reach all the way up with your right. Maybe gaze your finger, your fingertips. Maybe reach, maybe gaze all the way to the sky. And release, plant all fingers to the ground. Bring yourself back to the downward dog. And whenever you're ready, inhale. Lift the left leg this time. And kick it to the front. Adjust whenever necessary. Adjust the back. Adjust the back leg. Whenever you're ready, reach all the way to the sky with your left. Maybe gaze all 10 fingertips, all fingertips, or gaze all the way to the sky. And release. Lower yourself down this time. Untuck the toes and twist to your left. Whenever you're ready, reach all the way up. Warrior one variation. Just breathe. With your next exhale, Wire two variation. So just making sure that all that your front, left, knee stats, your ankle facing the front of your mat. For wire two. Whenever you're ready. Flip your arm for side, reverse side triangle. Maybe look all the way to the sky. Maybe gaze at your fingertips. And just breathe. Inhale, wire two. Flip the arm. Reverse triangle. And just breathe. With your next exhale, place all 10 fingers back to the ground. Bring your knee back. Tuck the toes, bring yourself back to downward dog pose. Whenever you're ready, kick the right leg this time and bring it to the front of your mat. Lower yourself down. Twist your knee to the right this time. 
with your next inhale reach all the way up warrior one variation then just breathe maybe gaze all the way to the sky maybe gaze at your stars your next exhale warrior two variation you can gaze the front fingers this time flip the arm and reach all the way to the sky reverse triangle and just breathe Look at all the fingertips. Maybe look at the sky. Exhale, warrior two. And again, inhale, reach all the way up to the sky. Maybe gaze at all fingertips. Exhale, release. Plant all 10 fingers back to the ground. And twist the knee, tuck the toes, bring yourself to the front to a fold forward. It's okay if you can't touch the ground. If you have a block, use your block. If you don't have a block, it's okay and just place fingertips to the ground. Inhale, half lift. And exhale, fold forward. You can also use your index and wrap around your big toe to bring you closer and just breathe if there's a bit of a bend it's okay inhale all the way up reach all the way to the sky Exhale, bring your palms together right at the heart center. Inhale, all the way up. Reach all the way to the sky. And this time, marry your fingers, except for the index. Exhale, to the right. Inhale, back at the center. And exhale to the left. Inhale all the way up. And exhale, release. Place your hands next to your hips. Maybe uh, try and place your feet parallel to the mat parallel to your mat or you can have or at an angle reach with your next inhale we'll reach our arms all the way up exhale fold forward again if that's not just always have a block to use you can use whichever you need this block has three height so it's your choice 
to use. With your next inhale, reach all the way up, all the way to the sky. Maybe gaze. your fingertips. Exhale, cactus the arms. Bend the knees. Open the chest. Inhale all the way up. Straight, straighten the legs. Reach. Look all the way to the sky. Reach your arms all the way to the sky. With your next exhale, Cactus the arms, open the chest, bend the knees, and just breathe. Inhale all the way up, reach all the way to the sky. Exhale, release, place your hands next to your hips. This time we'll face the front of our mat. Left knee stacking the ankle. The back leg is parallel to the back of our mat. Maybe bring your hip to the right. Maybe bend your knees. Just adjust for your, for your comfortable, not too wide, not too small either, not too narrow. You may use a block. You can place it on the outer side, the front. Or if you don't have a block, you can use your shin and reach all the way. Reach your arm all the way to the sky. Maybe gaze at the sky, maybe gaze at your finger, fingertip, and release. Bend your knees this time for warrior two. So again, the hip is almost like facing here. So your body is at an angle. It's not at the front of your mat. So go ahead, bend the knees for warrior two. Whenever you're ready, flip the arm. Reach all the way to the sky, strafe, strafe in the legs. And maybe there's a more bend. So go ahead. And just breathe here. Maybe look at your thumb. And exhale, bend the knees. Warrior two. Inhale, um, flip the arms. Inhale, all the way up, strengthen the front knee and reach all the way. Maybe gaze at your thumb. Maybe you're just here. Whichever you're more comfortable. And release all the way. Place all 10 fingers to the ground. Adjust your leg. Adjust your leg. And twist with your left all the way to the sky. And just breathe. And 
release, plant all ten fingers. Whenever you're ready, reach all the way up. One and one. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, all the way up. All the way to the sky. Reach all the way to the sky. And release. Now adjust yourself again. This time we'll face the front, the back of our mat. The back leg is parallel to the back of the mat, the front mat. Bend your knees. You can straight the leg, bring a block here with you. If you have a block, it's your choice to place it to the front, the back, and reach all the way up with your left this time. Draw the shoulders back further from the ear, and release. Place the block on the side. Place all your 10 fingers to the ground. Adjust your back leg. And whenever you're ready, reach all the way with your left. This time, maybe gaze at the sky, maybe gaze at your fingertips. And just breathe. Release. Bring the front, bring it all the way to the back for downward dog pose. Adjust yourself maybe from back to the front of your mat. Tuck the toes. Twist your body to the right for plank pose. And just breathe. Release the arm. Back. Adjust yourself. Lower yourself. Vinyasa. Untuck the toe, place your forehead to the ground, all ten fingers facing the ground. You may adjust whenever necessary down to your rib cage and just breathe. Inhale for baby cobra. And exhale, back to the ground, forehead to the ground, and just breathe. Tuck your toes, bring yourself all the way up. Twist your body to the left this time for plank pose. Reach all the way up to the sky. Maybe gaze at all, at all fingertips. Maybe gaze all the way to the sky. And just breathe. Release. Lower yourself down. 
Give me a sec. Your forehead touching the ground. You can cut your hands. All the way, all ten fingertips to the ground. Inhale. Do the cobra variation. Exhale to the left. Inhale back at the center. And exhale to the right. Inhale back at the center. And release your forehead to the ground. Place your forehead to the ground. Release the arms. You can place them on the side. You can stay there if you wish to, or you can interlace. All ten fingers to the back. Inhale all the way up for baby cobra variation. Exhale. Forehead to the ground. We'll do this a few more times. Inhale. For baby cobra. Variation. And exhale. Back to the ground. And just breathe. You may release all ten fingers if you interlace them. You're welcome to place your temple, your ear to the right, facing the right, and just breathe. Whenever you're ready, place all ten fingers, just maybe close to your chest, tuck the toes, bring yourself all the way up to a downward dog pose. You may walk your feet from back to the front, your hands from back to the front, and just hold it here for five, four, three, two, one. With your next inhale. Bring your right leg all the way to the back. Maybe point your toes. And kick it to the front. Lower yourself back. Back down on your... Next inhale, all the way up. Low lunge. And just breathe. Exhale all the way down. Plant all ten fingers back to the ground. Twist your knee to the right. Inhale all the way up. And exhale all the way to the ground. Cut all ten fingers to the ground and just breathe. 
And if you have a block, you can use the block. And just breathe. Twist your body back to the ground. Place all ten fingers. Untwist your knee. Tap your toes. Bring yourself back to downward dog pose. This time, whenever you're ready, Kick the back leg and bring it to the front. Lower yourself. Inhale all the way up. Oh, it's okay if you wobble. And exhale, fold forward. Twist the knee to the back. To the right this time. Inhale, all the way up. And exhale, fold forward. Go ahead, use a block if that's accessible for you. Or you can just stay where you are. Whenever you're ready, inhale all the way up and exhale, twist your body to the front. Untwist your knee. Bring yourself to the front. Tuck your toes for fold forward. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold forward. With your next inhale, chair pose. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, chair pose. Sit lower. Reach your arms all the way to the sky. Maybe gaze all fingertips and fold forward inhale all the way up and release back just place your hands on the side we'll bring ourselves down All the way down whenever you're ready. Go ahead. You're welcome to close your eyes and just breathe. You're welcome to place your hand, one hand on the belly, one hand on the chest, and just breathe. You may flutter the eyes open if you close them. Whenever you're ready, adjust your feet. about three to four inches. Place all 10 fingers on the side of the mat. With your next inhale, lift your core.
call your core all the way up. Slowly, vertebrae by vertebrae. Exhale, lower yourself down, vertebrae by vertebrae. Place the tailbone all the way to the ground. Next inhale, lift the arms. Lift the core all the way. Strong core. Strong. And exhale. Lower yourself down vertebrae by vertebrae. We'll do it again. We'll do it again a few more times. Next, inhale, lower the arms. Lift yourself all the way up. Strong core. Strong glutes. Exhale, lower yourself down. This time, place your right foot to the left on top of your knee. Maybe hug your feet from the hole or from here. Draw your knee closer to the chest. And just breathe. Maybe point your toes to the back of your mat. Slowly release the foot back to the ground. Both feet to the ground and this time your left ankle on top of your right knee. Move your knee close to your chest and hug from the hole. Or do your shin. Maybe point your toes back to the back of the mat. And just breathe. Release whenever you're ready. Place all both legs. Toes facing up. One hand on your belly and one hand on your chest. And just breathe. Whenever you're ready, bring both knees to your chest and just give them a hug. Maybe sway it from side to side, from left to right. Back to the ground, both feet 
front kid to the ground. Maybe sway it from left to right. Your hands back to your chest, one on your belly. Go ahead and rest to your left. Maybe your right arm extends to the right along with your gaze. You may stay here if you wish to or place your left ankle on top of your right knee and breathe. Inhale. You can release the knee if you put, if you place your ankle. You can rest to the right this time. Place your right hand on the belly. Extend your left arm this time along with your gaze. You can stay here if you wish to or place your ankle on top of your knee and just breathe. Place the arm on your chest, release the knee if you place the ankle on top of your knee. You can bow, you can take, you can hold for a baby pose. You can hold your feet on the, on the side or inner. And just breathe. You can stay here or you can place it down both soles facing you can place your hands on top of your belly and one on your chest and just breathe Extend the left leg whenever you're ready. Hold your shin, hold your right shin. You can choose to hold it on the outer or the inner. Choice is yours. You can stay here if you wish to or extend to your right. Extend your left arm and bring your gaze along with it if you want. And just breathe. If you extend your arm, you can place it back to your belly and release the foot. Extend the right foot. Grab your shin with your left hand. You can hold it. Hold your foot on the outer or the inner. The choice is yours. You can stay here if you wish to. 
or you can extend to the left if you wish to maybe extend your right arm this time along with your gaze and just breathe If you extend your arm, you may bring it back to your belly. Slowly release your foot back to the ground. Place your hand, one on the chest and one on your belly. And just breathe. Whenever you're ready, you can place yourself on either side, to your left or to your right, and just breathe. Place your temple to the ground, your ear to the ground. Whenever you're ready, press yourself up, back to a seated position. Bring your hands together, right to the center. Thank you for practicing with me today. We'll see you soon again. Namaste.